Shamanese guys came down to my place to take a uh, baby first to the crematorium and then I met them there at about 8 p.m. that night. Then uh, when we were there at the crematorium, so uh, initially we were supposed to have like this uh, private moment but I told the guys, I said that, you know, I'm going to be there alone so I don't need this private moment already so we can just go straight with the cremation. So um, I had my mask on because uh, I was really inside it was really very painful uh, you really don't know how to deal with the loss and you and my husband had to be at home with the three other kids so at the crematorium they had the baby there so I put the clothes the toys and all that and I think um, it was just again reopening the tear ducts again lah, you know so you cry again because you are wondering why this happened yeah and so it was very um, her guys are also very, very kind and very empathetic. So they gave the space that I needed to cry and all that. Then we went up to the, the space where, you know, you see the, the, the coffins being put to the incinerators, right? It's the same process. Yeah, so I was glad that I was alone because I just needed that space to cry and just be coming to terms up with the loss. Yeah, and like this is it long, you know. Because that little fetus that I saw will become ashes. Yeah. You know, you, you really don't want any mummies to go through this. So I was always thinking about my baby. So for the past 12 months, um, that little baby whom we named Joy was always on my mind. Even though shortly after, three months later, I conceived my next pregnancy, and of course it's a viable one, I still think of that little joy that we lost yeah, every single day so um, it's really not easy I think grief is really like a process that we all go through it's still a loss and how do you process this loss you, you, you never know you know because it's always your mind thinking and thinking about that what if you know what if the baby was still here you know I don't have to go through this pain you know, and I have to go through a confinement without holding any baby. You know, one day we will see our little lost ones in heaven. You know, they are being taken care of by God. So right now is our chance to work hard and be good in our earthly lives. Thank you for trusting in Harmony Funeral Care, your number one bereavement buddy.